This video, from OS College, demonstrates choosing a directory to save an only Office new document to in the Windows 10 version. Clicking the Save icon or Save item launches a Save dialog. The Save dialog for Windows 10 is similar to the Save dialog in Mac OS and various Linux operating systems, but it is also unique. The Save dialogs for any operating system is both unique and similar to others. Since only Office uses the save dialog of every operating system it is running on, OS College has videos about choosing where to save a new document for Mac OS, Ubuntu, Linux Mint, and Manjaro. The Windows 10 dialog has a column on the left side with top-level directories, key directories, and connected drives, such as USB sticks. There is also a list of directories at the bar at the top of the dialog that are separated by arrows. The one farthest to the right shows the directory that you are in. The ones to the left of it show which directories contain the one that you are in. This horizontal list of directories shows the hierarchical structure that the current folder is part of. Click the directories on the left and at the top to choose the desired directory where you want to save the new document. The contents of the chosen directory will appear in the middle section. The middle section contains directories and documents that are in the directory that you have just selected. Double-click a directory in the middle section if you want to enter it and save your document to it. If you want to organize the documents and folders in the chosen directory, click the four filter items at the top of the middle section. Name Date modified Type and Size Click one and the items in the middle section will change. Clicking name, for example, will organize the documents and folders alphabetically. Click name again and the order will be reversed. If you click on the arrow associated with the item, a list will appear with several choices. These choices are filters that will reduce what you see in the middle section. Name will have choices for ranges of letters. Click one of those choices and only documents and folders that fit into that range will be seen in the middle section. This is useful when you have a folder with a large amount of content that you need to reduce. You can also change how the middle section looks by clicking the drop-down menu at the right. The choices are Extra large icons Large icons Medium icons Small icons List Details Tiles And content Sometimes you need to create a new folder to save your document to. Before you create one, click folders in the left column, top hierarchical directory, and then the middle section to enter the desired folder or directory where you want to create the new folder. To create a new folder, click the new folder item that is located above the middle section creates a new folder icon in the current directory. There is a text box associated with it that has the words new folder highlighted in blue. Type over them with the desired folder name. Then press the enter or return key on your keyboard. You now have a new folder in the current directory. Double click the icon to enter the folder. When you have chosen the desired directory to save your new document or created it, give the new document a new name by typing it in the file name text box at the bottom of the dialog. And if desired, change the file format by clicking on the save as type menu and then clicking on the desired format in the list. After you have done this, click the save button. The newly created document is now saved in the folder you selected. Thank you for watching this video about choosing a folder to save your only Office document in Windows 10. If you are watching on YouTube, be sure to click the subscribe and like buttons. You will receive notification of future videos from OS College about only Office and other applications. Also check out the OS College YouTube channel, where there are more videos about only Office and other applications. There are also more videos, as well as web pages and articles about various applications at oscollege.com.